Why should security teams get involved in cloud discussions and, and, and how can they do that? So security teams should be involved um, in the cloud discussion and indeed in any discussion where a, a service is being provisioned or, or stood up by an organization. Um, the reason for that is because an organization will, will provision a service, it will, you know, it will use a cloud service in order to provide the business with a capability. Um, within that service as well, it's almost always the case that the organization will, will put data into that service. So that data could be anything really. It could be intellectual property. It could be sensitive data. It could be the personal data of our customers. So um, why should security teams get involved? Because if something happens that compromises that service or compromises the data within that service, then there are some well-documented and fairly serious repercussions in many cases. So in the first instance, as we've said, you know, that, that service has been provisioned to provide the business with the capability. Um, if that capability is taken away, then our ability to service customers is, is also impacted. Um, as well as that, there are in many cases, pretty severe punitive fines um, if data isn't deemed to have been looked after properly. And then there's all the other things that can ensue after after a, a breach or a security incident, um, reputational damage, loss of trust, and so on. So lots of really strong reasons for, for being involved. In terms of how uh, security can you know, make its way into these discussions, we see varying different approaches with different organizations. So I would say that in more mature organizations, we see that that security is, is championed and sponsored at the highest level within the organization. So at executive level, um, that is then manifested within the organization with security policies, with security standards, um, with ongoing training and awareness, and that's training and awareness for, for everybody around security, not just security folks, of course. Um, and, and then an ongoing assessment of security um, for, for any services or, or platforms or infrastructure that you're using. So a few different ways that, that the more mature organizations use. We also see some organizations who put gateways into the, the project life cycle. So um, you know, if, we're, if we're procuring a new cloud service, for example, then we might say, well, okay, we're gonna do a, a review um, as part of the project delivery to say, is this meeting with our requirements? Is it, is it protecting our data adequately? Um, and then yeah, last but not least, there's other things they can do. So they can talk to, to the likes of you and I, talk to the Salesforce partner ecosystem, talk to folks at Salesforce and, you know, ask the questions that, that you need the answers to. Yeah, perfect.